What's going on guys? Today I am back with another Destiny 2 video. Now Destiny 2 has way more customization options than Destiny 1 ever had. The main point to customization in my opinion is shaders and within Destiny 2 there are many many epic shaders. Today I bring you what in my opinion are the best 10 shaders in the game so far. But before we get into that guys, would you like to win some silver? If yes, simply drop a like on this video and tell me within that comment section what shader is your favourite. Winners are picked from my Discord server which is linked within the video description, so go join it people. Ok so 90% of these shaders are obtained from Bright Engrams, as it's here where all the best cosmetic items drop from. So let's get into the list and in at number 10 we have Metro Shift. This shade offers a nice black silver with blue highlights to your gear. Looks much better on some items over others, but I'm sure that's the case for all shaders within the game. In at number 9 we have Frumius Blue, now as soon as I saw this I fell in love and would definitely rock a full loadout using the shader, problem is I've only ever had 3 of these drop, but the nice white greys paired with that awesome looking blue, you can't go wrong here. In at number 8 we have Noble Constant Red, this shader a lot like Frumius Blue but instead of the blue it's replaced with a red. Again, a great shader which would look awesome on a full loadout. In at number 7 we have Xeno Silver, now this shader is amazing, the kind of pearlescent look it gives to certain pieces of gear is absolutely awesome looking. Shame it doesn't look great on everything though, but with the right loadout this would look impressive. In at number 6 we have Calluses Selected, this is the Leviathan Raid shader. Now I nicknamed this the Galahorn shader as on certain launchers it seriously makes them resemble the Galahorn. It's also a shader which to be honest I don't think looks bad on anything I've applied it to weapon wise. Armor wise though it's a difficult one, looks great on some but not so great on others. In at number 5 we have Midnight Talons, this was actually one of the first shaders I got from my Bright Engram, tried it out on a blue weapon and it just made my jaw drop. The dual blacks paired with that awesome bright gold makes this one seriously stand out, definitely one for a future gear set for me. In at number 4 we have Vanguard Magnus Gloss, now this shader comes in two forms, a standard rare Vanguard Magnus version which in itself looks pretty decent, but then you got this legendary version which adds gloss to that very same look and boy it looks amazing, particularly on Suros gear, the oranges and blues just stand out a treat, a colour combo I've always loved and with the right full gear set this would look incredible. In at number 3 we have Indigo Matrix, now this shader is a true pearlescent shader, it basically changes tone on different viewpoints which is amazing, looks absolutely awesome on armors too, but there are a couple of people out there that don't like this kind of shader which is fine, we all like different things, me personally I can't stand cakes, but give me sardines, corned beef and tomato sauce on toast any day of the week. This is one of them shaders, you either absolutely love it or you think it's terrible looking. In at number 2 we have Dawn and Dusk, what can I say, for sure it's a little girly, but nowadays most boys like to be girly, most boys spend more time doing their hair than I spend doing a raid, 
Now I actually love this thing, a full gear set of this would indeed make you seriously stand out, definitely while you're trying to hide in corners in PvP like I do. And when you jump out on somebody they ain't gonna know what's happening, this giant titan tranny is coming for you. But on a serious note, this shader is absolutely amazing looking. In at number one and my favourite shader in the game so far is Cerulean Divide. Now I'm actually hoping you guys don't all agree with me here as I want to explore different shaders you guys recommend to me. So if this is not your favourite shader in the game and I haven't mentioned your favourite shader within this list let me know what it is down below within the comment section but this one right here is definitely my favourite which I've obtained. It gives your gear that kind of dual black carbon fibre look but then applies an awesome blue highlight to that very gear. I actually haven't applied this to anything which hasn't made my eyes water through not blinking by being gobsmacked at how awesome this looks. It's one of those shaders which will make you use gear which isn't right for the situation you are in but you'll use it anyway because of how good that gear looks with this shader on. The Cerulean Divide is definitely the best shader for me within the game so far. And on that note guys, we have come to an end. Let me know down below within that comment section what is your favourite shader within the game. If you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really does help me out. If you are new around here and want to be in with the most active Destiny channel on YouTube, be sure to subscribe. If you never want to miss any of my daily uploads, hit that bell button next to that subscribe button to receive email notifications of when I do upload. And hopefully people, I will see you on my next video.